this is a lot better than the first one we did. Hey, what's that, Betty? My new addition to the home cafe. Oh my god. Too you many know, things. Sometimes you want to take a coffee away. Not bothered to wash a cup or something, you know. It's going to get very dirty. It look complete now, right? Oh, yeah. by the way, just to mention, we have four of this and this is our last one. Currently, this one is here. Yeah, currently one bag is in here. Yeah. It's called the Captain's Roast. And then my favourite is which one? I think it's like the everyday one. Yeah, everyday right? one is good. Anyway, I'm going to do my coffee right now. I'll probably have one of my favourite cups. And zero it out. Depends. Depends on what time of the day it is. Uh, maybe two more beans. That's oh, it. Perfect. Yeah. That's right. And then now I prep. Get one of these. Put it on top. WDT tool. And just do a few swirls. Give it a tap. Pretty level now. I like to give it two presses. And then a shower screen to protect the shower head from getting dirty. Crap in there. But I don't know if that's gonna be possible. That's decent. Imagine it as a shin ramen cup. There's a technique to it, and I'm only just beginning to understand it. What's the technique? This lovely cup is a temperature indicator, so it's good to use for coffee beginner like me. <laughs> and me. <laughs> and hopefully your milk look glossy. Swirl it around, fall off a little bit high, go dead center, and then whoosh, whoosh. funny sound effects. A lot better than the first one you did <laughs> for um, the I'm brand. practicing, you know. Yeah, that's it. Now we are here, Rudy's Pizza. Let's go. Let's go.
No video? No worries. First time we come to here, Col Colombian market. Is it cheaper? I think it's similar price. Each girl here is holding the brown paper here. It's showing, showing the love, showing the passion. <gasps> Lavender, I smell. <laughs> I think you will die under our care. It's very yeah. Smell good, smell good. Is this the one you see in Hong Kong? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You look like. More flower here. Look at the price. Yeah. So far, this is the precious flower shop I ever seen. Nice flower. Who's next? Why you like this game so much? Yeah. Hey guys, we have been invited for a food collab in London Bridge area. Yeah. Oh, here it is. Hi. Hi, this is the restaurant. Looking good. I can see why it's called the uh, bricks because the actual interior is like a brick theme. You can see all the bricks around the whole place. Oh, nice, right? Yeah. There's like red, there's like red neon lights around the restaurant as well. It's quite big. Guys, let me show you on the other side. Looking cool. Like open kitchen, isn't it? Any handsome chef? No. Got myself some cinnamon mocktail or something like that. I have no idea. Have some fancy fancy blueberry on top. And mince, right? Mince, yeah. yeah. And my one is blood orange. Blood orange. Freshly squeezed. Freshly, yeah. Black. So we usually put one light stick and one lens when we go to the food collect. And let me taste this bloody orange. <laughs> Quite nice. Do you want to try? Yeah. How's it? Oh, well, that's quite nice. <laughs> your one, your one. Try your one. Also quite nice. It's a taste of like cinnamon and ginger and... Let me have a taste and let you know. Might be nice for you, isn't it? Quite special. Yes. Another appetizer come. This is a uh, honey and garlic chicken wings. This restaurant is, they provide this lemon scent wet white for us to use after food. Do you smell my lemon? First of all, we have this pickle, my favorite. I can eat the whole jar by myself. That's why we go too. <laughs> really? Okay. Yeah. And then this is the main for yeah. brisk box. Yeah. Something like that. We have a yeah. steak, prawn, a lot of bread, my enemy. And then on this side, we have sweet potato fries with some sauce and lastly we have these pepper beans and sweet corn 
Hooray! Give me five. Cutting? Shall I record? I don't want the face. You don't want the face to show it. Finish our collab and then we went it's, outside. It's raining. It's raining. <laughs> you can see that. Yeah. By the way, do you realize uh, when we when you do a photo photographing, there are some couple next to us staring at you? That tends to happen whenever we do a food collab. Especially we get a lot of looks. If we, if we have holding this. Line. Yeah. This is such a uh, you Useful know. Useful line. It's useful light, but then but it draw attention draws well. attention. I like to be low key, but unfortunately, with that kind of light, <laughs> <laughs> especially when I'm like accidentally changing the mode and it starts doing like RGB rainbow lighting. Yeah. <laughs> and, and also when we're standing up as well, because we sometimes do the shot yeah, of the whole table, and then you would draw everyone yeah. looking. So there are two types of food collapse. One is you get to choose what you want the choice is completely yours and there's usually some sort of budget the restaurant may tell you uh, you get one side one drink one main one dessert something like that usually on the other hand they they may choose for you instead and that's when sometimes the order may get a little bit funny you may get some food that you don't really particularly like but it's a food collab at the end of the day you have to photograph it you know, you're but there the to kind of like ask in advance, like what kind of food they want. Yeah, exactly. So that you can guarantee you won't get disappointed. That's it. But in my opinion, getting to pick is usually better. You get the choice. Do you agree? Yeah. Nice. So because you can like, for example, if you choose a very light uh, appetizer, maybe a salad or something, then your main you can choose something more heavy. But if they choose it for you, they may choose all the fried food in the end. Just yeah, like just like we did in the past. like what happened to us once, right? Yeah. And sometimes they may tell you, oh, you can only pick from this menu. Anyways, it's raining and we gotta get home. We'll catch you guys soon. Noodles after work, straight away after a good collab. Dancing. <laughs> Can you elaborate on uh, why you need cup noodles? What, I'm still what happened? Hungry. You're still hungry? Because it's not enough cups. I like eating a lot of noodles. <laughs> As predicted, Peggy is eating shrimp ramen. Homey! Careful it doesn't fall. <laughs> hey guys, so the idea of this massive thing is actually like this. You go enjoying putting the guitar. <laughs> Look at me. Dun -dun -dun. Originally from here, Freddy asked me to cross the road and turn around and went to Regent. Our location is just here, Oxford Street surface. Now he made me walk back. Do you even know what the street is called? No, I'm right. Yeah, so you're relying on me for navigation. Yes, you are very good at driving, but in terms of Google Maps in pedestrian, you're very bad. Yeah. Carame.
Chocolate. Uh, uh, uh. Chocolate. We should eat that first, to be honest. Oh, yeah. Next, next. 